Well, this is a clip with an update on that uh, Oregon uh, seed situation. Um, and uh, my question is, this has been going on for a month. If these had been uh, Muslims that had taken over that facility, this wouldn't have gone uh, for more than a day. But anyway, this is just a further update on what's going on over there. Breaking news in Oregon tonight, the FBI confirms it has surrounded the National Wildlife Refuge where four supporters of M. Bundy are still occupying the federal facility. The FBI released a statement a short time ago saying in part, quote, we reached a point where it became necessary to take action in a way that best ensured the safety of those on the refuge. The FBI says shortly after 4.30 p.m. Pacific time, one of the remaining occupiers left the barricades they had set up at the compound on an all-terrain vehicle. Agents tried to approach him, but he quickly returned to the encampment. The FBI statement stresses that no shots have been fired tonight. A post made a few moments ago on the Bundy Ranch's Facebook page tells supporters, quote, wake up, it's time. And it adds that Ammon's father, Cliven Bundy, is headed to Burns, Oregon. Now, I'm going to say this again. If this had been uh, 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 Muslims that had uh, taken that place over or black people that had taken that place over, this bullshit wouldn't have gone a day. And if they let Clive and Bundy get anywhere near uh, that facility, uh, there, there's no justice in America. As a matter of fact, they should have uh, locked his ass up uh, the first time uh, when he didn't uh, pay his bills that everybody else in his area is paying and that if you or I had owed that kind of money, our asses would have been in jail. But, uh, you know, that's America for you. Land of uh, the privilege. Um, white privilege? Yeah, I guess it is. White privilege. Okay.